I'm getting ready for spring and that means cleaning out my containers for my container garden and I cleaned them out real well I dumped out the soil and I realized they are very faded from the Sun I've been using these now for about five years and I recalled a product I saw advertised several years ago I think it's called wipe new recolor where it gives kind of a facelift to uh, a lot of different products, plastic, metal, wood, anything that's been faded from the sun, you're supposed to just be able to wipe this on and it's supposed to be easier than painting and make things look new again. So I thought I'd give it a try. I purchased it at the store. They did not send this to me to do a review. And so it comes with six applicators. You have a pre-moistened cloth along with three clean cloths and then you have like a little sponge and then a wand for getting into little crevices and then it comes with a little bottle of the recolor coating and that's about two ounces it's a small bottle but it goes a long way and then a pair of gloves which you will need to use so I cleaned my pots out pretty well the instructions are very good very easy to follow and it has instructions for just about anything you want to cover so I'm going to do plastic and metal here um, and so like I said I cleaned my pots you know pretty good it's I'm just doing a rough job. I just wanted to see how it worked and then show you guys in case you wanted to do something before um, the summer sets in and the hot sun. So you basically just want to wipe it on. This is the pre-moistened cloth and you just overlap just a little bit. They compare it in the instructions um, to mowing a lawn. So you just, just wipe it on in one stroke. Um, I went ahead and put a little hole in the top seal. I didn't want to open up the seal the top of the bottle all the way because I was afraid I might pour too much out so I'm just dropping it into one of the other cloths here the first cloth that's pre moistened lasts a while so I think I did two or three pots with it and so now I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of them So this is when it's wet, but when it dries, it still has a nice new color to it. So I really liked it a lot. And if you were doing a real good job, you could just use that wand and get into the little cracks and crevices there. Now I'm not doing the um, bottom or the inside of the pot just because I want to just have it, you know, kind of fresh and clean looking. Um, I do grow edibles, so I don't really want to have it on the inside. So this is what it looked like when it was starting to dry. It's a big difference. It really is. So I let those dry. You're supposed to let them dry 24 hours. And you definitely need to do this outdoors because it smells like paint. <laughs> um, but it's not paint. It's a lot easier. I can tell you that for sure. So make sure that you don't have rain in the forecast for a little while. So I went ahead and tackled my patio furniture as well. Um, this is a metal furniture here. And it's factory painted. So you can't really tell much of a difference here, but I could. And I went ahead and did my chairs too. I didn't do the legs and everything. So I'm just doing a quick facelift on the furniture and I really do like how it worked out here. So this is a place where that wand would come in handy because you could get down into the crevices here and um, like I said I'm just doing a quick job I just wanted to see how it worked. So I went ahead and I also did my bird feeder and I'm sure I'll find some more things to use this on because I ended up with I guess about a quarter of the bottle left and that's quite a bit really because you would think a little bottle like that wouldn't go very far but it does. So hopefully this has given you some ideas of ways that you might can use this and I'll leave a link below the video if you'd like to check it out. It's available on Amazon and thanks so much for watching. Y'all have a beautiful day.